So people really wanted to know my opinion on the recent announcement by Manjaro's Cinnamon Edition that they're going to be switching to Vivaldi as their default browser because obviously I'm a big proponent of free and open source software, right? I don't really think distribution should be shipping proprietary software where it's really not needed. Obviously, things like proprietary video drivers, proprietary Wi-Fi drivers, those things are absolutely necessary. Otherwise, certain hardware people are going to be running in their machines is not going to work. And I understand why you have to ship some proprietary software because there's no free alternatives to some of this proprietary software. But when it comes to things like a web browser or an office suite, um, there's really no reason not to use things like Firefox and LibreOffice. And, you know, I had a big issue with the main editions of Manjaro uh, a couple of years ago when they wanted to switch away from shipping LibreOffice by default on Manjaro and start shipping FreeOffice. FreeOffice, despite the name, is not free software. It's actually a proprietary office suite. And I thought that was ridiculous because FreeOffice isn't better than LibreOffice in any way. It's just a different office suite, but it's licensed under a proprietary license, which kind of goes against the whole ideals of good news slash Linux. I mean, Linux is at the heart of our operating system, the Linux kernel. The reason the Linux kernel is so popular, the reason Linux as an operating system is so popular is because Linux chose in 1992 to license itself under a free license, the GPL version 2, and if they had never open sourced their uh, kernel and, and licensed themselves under a free license that people like the GNU project could get behind, we would have never had our operating system, the GNU slash Linux operating system. And uh, people should know that. People, especially that create Linux distributions, should know that history and they should learn from it. So you don't want to be pushing proprietary software on your users because maybe not a majority of Linux users, but certainly not an insignificant percentage of the Linux community does not like to promote proprietary software. They don't like to use proprietary software unless it's absolutely necessary. I'm certainly one of those people. And because of that, you know, I don't really like what the Manjaro team did with FreeOffice. I don't like what the Manjaro Cinnamon Edition is doing, pushing Vivaldi, which is a proprietary web browser. And there's no reason to push a proprietary web browser when we have literally dozens of free and open source browsers. And web browsers, for the most part, all of them are pretty good. All of them are usable, whether it be free and open source browsers like Firefox, LibreWolf, uh, Waterfox, all the Firefox-based browsers, uh, IceCat, you know, GNU IceCat, or even some of the Chromium-based browsers like Chromium, ungoogled Chromium, Brave is free and open source. I love Brave. Cute browser is free and open source. I mean, we have so many good open source browsers. We don't need to push proprietary garbage like Vivaldi or Chrome or Microsoft Edge. I'm sure they're all great browsers, but they really don't belong on our operating system, a free operating system that is GNU slash Linux. Now, the maintainer of the Manjaro Cinnamon Edition, it's a community edition, that's not one of Manjaro's official flavors, and the maintainer of any Linux distribution, obviously, can choose to ship whatever he wants on his or her Linux distribution. So, I mean, it's, it's this person's choice. The only thing I would say is that the people that make these choices need to understand the consequences of these choices because they are going to anger people. They know this. <laughs> so, you, you have to understand that there's going to be some backlash from it. If you're prepared to accept that, hey, go for it. If you want to ship Vivaldi on your Linux distribution, fine. Just know that many people are not going to like that. Many people are not going to use your distribution because of that. And people that have a, a public voice like me, a public platform, many of these people like me, we're just not going to promote your Linux distribution anymore. Anyway, that's just some of my thoughts on this. Peace, guys.